What up guys, welcome back to the channel. It is the stepladder final today for the 2024 Molson Masters Tournament. We are just getting underway here and we're getting ready for the Hall of Fame presentation. So we're gonna bring you some of that and we're gonna bring you all the action from today's matches. We got four in the seniors and five bowlers in the open. It's gonna be a lot of good action going on today. So stay tuned for it guys. Well, I can introduce one at five. First, I'd like to introduce three members of the board of the association. Dan Dumashow, Darren Alexander, and Wayne Ducks. The first inductee is a posthumous inductee, Dan Rose. Dan spent over 50 years involved in the association of both in Essex County and Winter Essex County. He was a junior program coach for over 54 years. He held numerous positions within the junior program. He was a member of the board of directors. He was with the Canadian uh, Federation Board for a coach for a year, National Board, committee for three years. He was also the Canadian Youth Championship of all for five years, and on air board for five years. On February 17, 2024, we went to the Dan Rose, who take on his behalf of the Dan Rose. By the way, that was for uh, promotion of the territory service. This next individual falls under the category of stars of yesterday. I don't know if that means he's older or not, but uh, that's all other issue. Uh, Mark Moran from McGregor. He's been the bowling for well over 39 years. He had a high average of 229. He's had a high, high series of 837. Since series, he had five 300 games, but well, you can add 30 to that because he bowled 30 more on, in unsanctioned leagues, but on sanctioned lanes. Uh, he's the most champion in the senior division in 2019. Duly deserved. Inducted to the <laughs> County Hall of Fame, February 17, 2024, Mark Moran. Uh, <laughs> Finally, this individual is being uh, inducted into the category of superior performance, Mark Moran. Remember, remember of the local bowling here for 36 years, 17 300 games, 8 800 series, the high series of 835, three times on the All Star team, besides that was 237. He was a CEW regional champion, more importantly, in 1996 and 2008. He was one of two left handers to win the most matches in the last 49 years. Inducted into the Winter SK Kelly Hall of Fame, February 27. 2024, Mark Moran. <laughs> 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 All right, congratulations to all the inductees, and thanks very much for the association for allowing me to do this.
Alright guys, so Jay Heron just won that match to move on to the final. I didn't get too many clips from the previous senior match, and a lot of that is my legs can't handle where I'm sitting to film, so I kind of give myself a break. Uh, the finals are set now for both the Open and the senior division. In the senior, which is up next, we have Mark Laborde and Bruce Cockburn, and then in the Open, we have Darren Alexander as the number one seed, and Jay Heron, who was the two seed going at it for the title.
Mark.
at number four. That's a significant number. The number you're looking for is seven. So number four now, representing uh, Rio Chabot, Don Taylor again, bring up the trophy, and a bunch of money, about $2,000 worth. Your 2024 champion, Darren Alexander. Back for Darren in the open. He has now won this tournament four times. That is incredible. And congratulations to Mark Laborde, who now has won it for the first time in the seniors. And he won the open back in 2004. So congratulations to both our winners here today. What a great show, as it always is. And thank you guys for tagging along and watching what I was able to record for you today. And that is all for today at Rev's Rose Bowl here in Windsor, Ontario. Until next time, guys, peace.